Well, g'day Kurt Nerds. Uh, hopefully this is being streamed on multiple platforms at the moment. I'm just doing a quick live cheese making video uh, just to see what this software works like. Um, currently I'm making um, Brevi Bacterium Linens. I've got the pot there with the milk in it in the background there. And then you can see all of my utensils and all of the cultures and stuff all laid out. And then on the sink area, you can see that I've got my brick mold. I'm actually making brick, and who's that? We've got BWG, g'day, how are you? Fantastic to see you. Um, so I've got my brick mold there, and uh, yeah, I've got all my camera gear set up because I'm filming this for a video tutorial, so pretty cool. So we've got lots of people on board, which is great from YouTube. Um, hopefully we'll get some from Facebook and the rest. So my normal, um, and I'll just turn the camera around. There we go. So I've got my colander all set up there and uh, also got my curd cutter that's all been sanitised. Brick mould. Now, I had a bit of trouble trying to find, uh, well, pressing plates. So I use this, so hopefully, um, well, I'm going to use that and then this later on when it gets smaller. So because of the size of the mould, you can see there, it's uh, not doesn't have straight sides, so it uh, flanges in. But anyway, we'll see how that goes as far as um, making brick goes. A um, few other people online. Um, first time on your stream. Oh, fantastic. Thanks, BWG. And as I said before, there's the pot. Let's move the thing down a bit. So there's the pot. It's got the milk in it. At the moment, we're uh, currently uh, coagulating. So I've just put the rennet in and that's going to sit for 45 minutes so that's going to be absolutely fabulous um, and then um, got all the the uh, ingredients so I'm using uh, Brevi Bacterium Linens because brick is a uh, a washed rind cheese and a washed curd cheese and then I've got uh, my thermophilic culture as well it's a good all rounder that's MOT uh, 92 by Sacco and all of my other utensils and stuff. I'm using a recipe out of a book that I've modified. This one's the 200 Easy Cheese Making Recipes. Um, pretty good book, um, but I've had to modify the recipe for size-wise and some of the steps. Hopefully it'll all be good. Okay, anyway, um, we're, uh, that's about it. Uh, just go back to... So that's about it. Just wanted to test this software out, see if it was uh, viable for uh, decent um, size videos and whether the video was too choppy and all that sort of stuff. But we'll see how it goes. Oh, g'day to um, Carolyn and Mike as well. So many people, it's fabulous. Now it's just me, um, obviously, on, on my mobile device. Um, and anyway, we'll call it uh, quits for now and uh, you'll see the brick video tutorial come out Probably in a week, maybe two weeks. We'll see how it goes. See how the cheese ripens. I want to show the um, the orange schmear, smear all over the um, the cheese. So we'll see how we go. Anyway, thanks for watching, Curd Nerds, for this very quick live video. And uh, stay tuned for another exciting uh, cheese-making tutorial.